Uh, how do you find the square root of 361? So uh, 361, the f uh, we want to find the square root of 361 here. So we want to figure out first, um, let's figure out first a factor of 361 here. So um, let's see. Factor of 361. So we want to figure out, okay, can we break this square root into uh, two different square roots, right? Can we find a factor of 361? So 361 is kind of actually hard because 361 is not even. So they're using they're using this as well. 361 is not even. That's what I, I kind of you kind of inspect this. It's not even. The sum of the digits is not a multiple of three, right? If I all multiple if I add up 3601, I would get 10 and that's not a multiple of 3 so it's not division of 3 which means I can't divide it by 4 uh, because it's not even I can't divide it by 5 because the last digit is not 5 or 0 which means I can't divide it by 6 can I divide by 7 let me try 7 here 361 divided by 7 divided by 7 would give me I would get a remainder so I would not it would not be 7 which means I can't divide by 8 because I can't remember I can't divide I can't divide by any number. Can't can't divide by any even number, right? So therefore, I have to try odd numbers, which means so. Let's see. So three doesn't work. Five doesn't work. So three, five, those are exhausted. Seven was exhausted before. I'm gonna try nine here. 361 divided by nine would also give me a remainder. So nine doesn't work. I can't divide by 10 because again, uh, or I can't also divide, cannot divide by five or 10 also because my uh, last digit is not zero or five, right? So nine doesn't work. Let me try 11. 361 divided by 11 would not give me a value as well. I still get a rem remainder. Let me try 13, 361 divided by 13. Also remainder, uh, 15 wouldn't work because again, I can't divide by five or 10 or any multiple of that. Uh, I'll try 16 doesn't work. So I have to try 17 here, divide by 17. 17 doesn't work. 18 doesn't work because it's even. And I have 19 here, let me try 19. And 19 does work, right? If I divide 361 by 19, I would get actually 19, which means the square root of 361 would be uh, 19. Now we can only basically do this if we're not given a calculator, right? Or if we're given a calculator, we can just shove this in and we'll realize this equals 19. So if I were to divide again, 361 divided by 19 here, divided by 19, you're gonna realize that I have one, so 19 times one is nine. This would equal uh, 17. And then bring down the one here, and then you realize this here has to be a nine, right? Nine times one is 81, plus nine here is seven. So this here would equal zero. So 19 would be my uh, answer here. 19 squared is because, so I can say since 19 times 19 equals 361, therefore square root of 361 equals 19. And this here is the only kind of a, only kind of a solution I can do without using a calculator, because I would have to basically try out all these, um, all these uh, factorizations to find out uh, which, which, uh, what it would divide into. So this here, solution has corrected. They did the exact same thing as I did if I wasn't given a calculator. So great solution, and then also solution here is correct.